Hello, Internet Technology students. This is your daily log for Monday, September 28th, and this is week number seven. So make sure you start up a new daily log, or, of course, you can make a copy of last week's and then just rename everything. That's an easy way to get that assignment started, and then you don't have to go through all that formatting again. Uh, but this is the first item for today, which is Monday, September 28th. First of all, you need to check your grades on Skyward and also your grades in the, in the classroom. As of tonight, which I'm, when I'm making this video, which is Sunday night, uh, the grade in Skyward will match the grade that you see in classroom. I have gotten uh, done away with the different assignment packets that I was talking about before. I think that was uh, confusing overall, so I got rid of it. Um, so you'll just see one grade in your Skyward account, and that will be the percentage grade that you have. It's, it's one assignment out of 100 points, and the number of points that you have is your percentage grade. Uh, that comes directly from the Google Classroom. Uh, I will be updating that once a week so that you have a current grade uh, every Thursday. If you need to see individual scores for assignments, then you should look inside of Google Classroom because that's where all of your assignments are anyway. Um, then you don't have to go back and forth between Skyward and Classroom. Um, if you have any questions about this, make sure you uh, send me some email. I'll try to explain it. Uh, but you should see your percentage uh, in Classroom. Uh, you'll see zeros if you, if you haven't turned in an assignment but that will be reflected in your percentage grade. Um, and then that percentage once a week will get copied into Skyward. So that is your official grade. Okay, the, the second reminder for today is that the chapter two test uh, was posted and it should have been taken by Friday at midnight. So if you did not take the chapter two test, you want to make sure you get that accomplished and finished. Most of you have done that. Uh, the first new thing for today, um, I wanted to have a how-to posted today for Chapter 3, but I don't have that done yet. So you should just continue work in Chapter 3 by just reading in the e-text um, and following along with what you're supposed to do for the file. So you have to read carefully about what you're doing. You'll be creating a journal and if you read through that, or they'll step you through that. Uh, but you'll be creating a journal uh, for the files that you're working on in Chapter 3. Okay, I'll be posting a how-to on that. And we are going to be uh, doing some rearrangement of the files that you have to get them more organized uh, as far as the different chapters go. Um, but uh, make sure you have... Uh, you're, you are following along with what they tell you to do inside of chapter three. Should This is like the third day uh, that you have been working on chapter three, right? It was posted last week on Thursday. So hopefully you've had plenty of time to be working on chapter three. Okay, uh, take care. Email me if you have any other questions or post a question inside of the assignments. Thank you. Bye-bye.